Hi friends, Tilly here. It's been an awful long time since I've been with you. And one of these days I'll talk about it. I have lost the use of my legs and um, a good part of the use of my right hand. Um, but I'm pretty good with my left, except I am right-handed, so I'm learning to <laughs> change. Uh, another thing that I'm going to have to learn is uh, how to set this camera up so that we'll be able to uh, talk with one another easier. And um, another thing I'm going to have to learn is how in the world I'm going to put this on my YouTube channel because YouTube has changed and I checked in and I got sent to a dashboard and I didn't know what to do with it. So hopefully this will get on. Um, I have had in the uh, meantime given away pretty much of my um, craft supplies and I kept some of the bigger things um, I guess just with a little hope in the back of my head but um, after my last surgery with my genius uh, neurosurgeon uh, Dr. Santiago if any of you are here in the Midwest close to uh, St. Louis and Big Barns, uh, you have a problem with your spine, you call Dr. Paul Santiago because this man is a saint. He's not a doctor, he's a saint. Um, at 72, I believe I was at the t 72 or 73 at the time of my last surgery, which boy, opened up part of the cervical um, spine and put in two uh, metal rods down the sides of the spine and then uh, cut open uh, space for the nerves to um, be able to start talking uh, to the muscles again so that I don't lose any more uh, muscle in my hands or arms. And at that point, um, I did a nasty little thing and had a little bout of AFib I'd never had before uh, in the middle of the surgery and probably scared him half to death. But I was sleeping, so I didn't mind. Um, but he was brave enough to go ahead and take uh, an old lady with uh, adult onset diabetes and, and um, way too much weight and go ahead and give me a chance to uh, be able to continue to use my hands at least and by golly he did it and I can't imagine many surgeons wanting to risk their reputation on somebody like me but he had no qualms and took me in and did the job and here I can move my hands and I even have um, enough strength in my legs that I can transfer. So there you go. And that's probably the biggest part of it all. But that's where I've been uh, the last couple of years. We um, we had, in the meantime, uh, hubby's no uh, young chicken either. And uh, being an old rooster, he's having trouble uh, helping me um, as much as he'd like and still take care of the condo that we were in when I used to be on all the time and so um, our children, our youngest daughter and her husband um, went out looking for a home, went out looking for a home for all of us, for their two children and themselves uh, with a place that um, might be uh, suitable to uh, um, have us come live to. Um, they found that, and it's very close to um, both our our oldest uh, daughter and her family, and uh, also very close to um, our son uh, and his family. So uh, we really have all all of the kids right here around us. Um, and we try to stay out from underfoot. 
they built us a beautiful um, uh, apartment down here in the in the basement of their new home. Um, and it doesn't feel like a basement. One day I'll take you on a little tour because the whole uh, side, a uh, whole one side of the uh, uh, fire apartment is all window. It's just window after window after window. So it is bright and shiny down here all the time. Um, anyway, enough of that. I was ordered by my uh, neurosurgeon to uh, start using my hands more and keeping them active and he asked me what I had done. Uh, I told him that I had I loved to craft and I loved to sew and I loved to paint and so he said well get back to it. So I figure I'm under doctor's orders <laughs> to craft and paint. Um, I didn't have a lot of uh, things left, uh, scoopy little things, you know, that we all have tucked away in our drawers. Um, and the first thing I did was go back to uh, creating a crafty life that I had belonged to for years before this all started happening and we uh, needed to move. And uh, they took me in, even though they <laughs> took me back in, even though they uh, knew that I didn't, um, that things might not be as, as nice as maybe they could be. Um, and uh, being there, um, ran into a, who we like to call ourselves or sisters just by uh, a different mother oh, and father. Um, but we are sisters in the fact that we have the same sense of humor. We, we uh, seem sometimes to uh, be thinking the same thing at the same time. And she was uh, concerned that I didn't have the things that I needed. And she was at that point trying to pare down her her closet of uh, um, scoopy things. And so she insisted that she send me a box of just that scoopy things. And I wanted to get this on video because I'm so thankful to her. What a wonderful thing. I mean, a really wonderful thing to do. And uh, when I got the box, I almost cried. It uh, came, um, I lost my mother about two weeks ago, and it came at the same time as we were getting all of that um, cleared up. And, and you got to know uh, a dear, dear lady was 95 years old. She spoiled us all by uh, staying so long with us. And and uh, now it, it's uh, got me shaking in my boots because I'm the uh, matriarch now of the family. So <laughs> Lord help the rest of the family. Um, I, I didn't get, I didn't want to get into the box then. And I did want to video it because I thought it was a grand gift to me. And so um, I think without any more of my rattling on, I'm going to go ahead and show you s some things. And I'm going to peek because I'm just about dying to see what's inside. Let's see what she sent. Well, we've got... First, it's stuffed in here so full that I don't know. Oh, look at these. Each one a different lace. I don't know if you can see this, and I'm in the way, I'm sure. I have to find a way to uh, set this up so that I'm more comfortable like I was before. But just believe me that these laces are gorgeous. Each one on their own little paddle. And I think that's a very good way to store it. I even have a little piece of... Um, a little piece of... Uh, ribbon that I can take off down here and use it also. So I'm going to hold on to that 
<clears throat> oh, some is even, it's so full. Oh, look, oh my gracious, look at that. I hope, I hope I'm even putting it in front of the camera. Okay, let's put this, let's see. And we have, oh, gorgeous, gorgeous flowers. We have, oh my, I'll have to take a look at this. Maybe something fell out, but there's a little tiny, a little tiny leaf in there. I'm going to have to see what, Jeez. oh my, oh my goodness, look at these. I will be putting together some flowers, my friends. I will be, I don't know if you can tell, but these uh, glow, it, no, the iridescent uh, sheen to them is absolutely beautiful. Oh, and there is a little button in here. Uh, I'm going to have fun just going through this by itself. And then I have a little, well, this says, moments, and it has little flowers, and a little, uh, what looks like a kind of a blackboard. And then behind it, there are, I'm sure, more flowers flowers back here. I'm just so afraid that I'm going to be out of camera. I'm sure that's what this is back behind it. I can't get... You're going to hear a lot of grumbling about these hands of mine don't work, but I still got them, so what? Thankful. Yes. Yes, I am. Oh my goodness, this is stuck stuff. We have wood. Oh, look at the wood. There's gorgeous frames. I'm not going to punish you all by listening to the paper rattle too much here or try to get them out. That's going to be my, my treat. I don't know if you can see this one. It's a little tiny bunny rabbit right there. If that isn't the cutest thing. But then it goes all the way up to huge uh, frames. Those are gorgeous. And, oh, little bitty, little bitty pumpkins. Oh, I'm sure I, I'm sure you're not able to see this also very well because of the lighting and because of the setup. <clears throat> but I just so want to honor her for what she's done. Ooh, pretty. Can you see those? They're mosaic pieces. And they also have a shine to them or a glint in them. Oh, and then we have our jar. Our jar of things. This looks like something I would keep buttons in, but she has charms, buttons, resin pieces. There's a beautiful cross, a Christmas tree down here. Oh, wait till I go through this piece by piece. I'll have something to do for the rest of my life just from this box. Just going through the Oh, look at these stickers. Forever. Forever love. My one and my only. I guess you know who some of these will be going to. That fella out there in the great room that's listening to the Monday Night Football game right now. I had to close my bedroom door because all you could hear are People, oh, all you could hear were people screaming and hollering and somebody made a touchdown. Yay! Um, oh, here's a Heidi Swap. Look at the uh, 
totally wonderful dream believe always and look at the look at the fun how delicate that is oh this is going to be beautiful absolutely beautiful my fumble fingers are going to not tear that up here's some more faithful adore best honor forever and if you can see i don't know if color is coming across because of my light but we got pinks and and uh, moss and and almost a lime um and then the what is the what is the color of the year is teal right all right which i love oh look at this make a wish do amazing things. That's gorgeous. Mm, I don't know if she should. No, don't. Let's not tell her. Let's not tell her just in case. Some bow bunny brads. Oh, how fantastic. And they're all different. You see, I don't get out to shop. And so they're are many things, I mean, I rely on all of you. Um, my sweet friend Kim, that uh, Kimbo Creations, it lets me know what's out there. Sometimes I can, I love these. Now, those little corners for your, for your photographs. Um, she lets me know, there are several of you that let me know what's out there. Look at these little masks how cute is that Aww. and let's see what's over here it's kind of heavy <clears throat> um so i kind of count on you guys to let me know what's out there and then sometimes i can bribe my grandchildren into going <laughs> I show them a picture from yours. Look at these tassels. I mean, very Egyptian, don't you think? How pretty. Oh, and there are, oh, there are more than tassels. We've got some more charms in here. Oh, hearts. Oh, these will be fun. These will be fun to play with. Uh, bribe my grandchildren into going up. I give them a picture. I let them watch videos from you all. And, and uh, oh my goodness. Pocket pages. Oh, these are... Let's see the... You are awesome. And a perfect day. I'm believing truly the perfect day is the one where you wake up in the morning... And have your cup of coffee. Look at these bows. Beautiful, beautiful. And I love, love bows. Boy, my goodness, she had to use a clip. Look at the size of this clip. Now this... <laughs> Let's see if I can even open this clip. We've got stickers in here. <laughs> okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Just that alone amazes me, the size of this. Um, oh, and look. I didn't know they came with the little sticks. Okay. We have... In my, I mean, I'm falling apart. Okay, numbers. <laughs> Even my eyes are going. And letters. Yay! Look at these. In close to that teal again. Kim. I know she's jealous because her favorite color is a teal. Um, it's, they're not wood, but they. Look as though they're wood. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Oh. 
Oh, I like this. Look at this. Talk about wild. And I'm doing some scrapbooking for the the two grandchildren that are here uh, that we live with. And boy, would these be perfect for them. They, uh, we've got one that uh, is a freshman in in high school, or I guess it's still considered junior high in this school district. Um, oop! I have an O. I have an O that escaped. But you know what? I'm going to leave it there because I don't want to tear it or rip the. I have to do it gently with my claws later on. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is the alphabet, but that that paper that it's a well of course it's a Tim Holtz of course it's beautiful um and the young young man that I am living with and making my own faux peanut butter cups for uh, is a junior this year oh look at this pretty this will work also but it all this is good for adults and kids. Who am I kidding? That's beautiful. Oh. Mm. These are lovely. And kind of old-fashioned looking. Boy, if that's not me. I'm just old, I guess. But I appreciate. <laughs> oh, these are pretty, too. Now this isn't, you might be seeing it as wood, but actually it's, there's um, blue. It's b the blue and, and taupe, and it's gorgeous. Gorgeous. Oh, look at this. This is just like burlap. Oh, I love that. Now see, she had to have meant these for me. She had them together in a big clip, so it wasn't that some of her stuff fell in. Alpha. Boy, Anne, when you talked about sending a few things, you were not kidding. Oh, look at these. Oh, these will work wonders. These are the very, um, the very small letters, and I have them. Uh, prayer journal, kind of a walk in faith that I do, and and these letters are going to be exactly the right size for my little book. Uh, and and <laughs> I may use them for a few, uh, for a few. Uh, there's more in here too. I I mean I can't get to it, but there is more in here. And in order to keep this from not lasting an hour. I'm boring the tears out of all of you except me. I'm so excited. Um, I'll keep moving, but I want you to know there's more in that package than just those beautiful small letters in black and gold. More goodies. I mean... There are... Oh my goodness, there are corks, shells, beads, what I like to call trinkets. Here are the, uh, binder, the binders, the rings for binders, and also a lot of uh, clothespins. Oh, oh, scoopy stuff. Oh, looks like a chip. Only it's got... Oh, it does. It has uh, uh, spades, hearts, clubs. It's, my God. Oh, and a huge key. Do you see this? Can you see this? This is just gorgeous. Oh, what do I do, and Just take a bag a day, open one bag at a time, and see what Scoopy is in that bag for real. Here's another bag. Oh, of these connectors for 
some. Uh, I'm not going to be able to think of the names of them. Some of these are, okay, they're clips, they're paper clips. Look at this watch, pocket watch. That's gorgeous. This heart is absolutely beautiful. There are some rhinestones in here. And I honestly thought there were a couple. No, I'm thinking that most all of these are uh, paper clips of some sort. Or another, each one of them with a shape, like a violin or a key or um, a chair or the state of Texas. You know, here's one that uh, is a music note. Uh, so, oh, this one's going to be fun to go through. Then, oh, another. <clears throat> I have, I'll have to get hubby to to break these open, I can't, uh, don't have the muscle to do that. I, I'm poking. I've got bits and pieces of papers, flowers. I bet you every one of these oh, oh look. This bag is filled with bags, with bags of things, oh, and I can't get it open. I'm so sorry. Oh, well, this I'll take to bed with me tonight. After he throws my legs in bed, then he can open this for me, and I'll sit there and play through this bag, first of all, the one that I'll need opened. I'll let you know what it is, though. <laughs> I won't keep secrets from any of you. What else? Have... Oh, my. Oh, these are beautiful hearts. And, but they're out of... Um, They're very, they're very, very thin. Um, it's not a... I'm trying to... It might be some of the material that we use for shaker. I mean, that's how thin it is. All these pieces of wonderful things. Well, I can't even tell you, but it's... They're all already... I mean, you don't have to worry about using a die. They're cut out. Um, this is summer. We have, but I, but this material is, here's the word hope. These are just, and this hope is gorgeous. I don't know if you can tell, but it's another one of those that has the a holographic look to it. Oh, and the oh dear, there went into my lap or onto the floor, which is where a lot of things end up. I'm going to put this down before I drop any more until he comes in to give me a hand. Um, oh, look at these! Holy crumb, these are gorgeous. Huge, beautiful bows. Oh, these girls, these girls have some talent. That's, I'm sure, why Anne has so many beautiful things. It's they, I mean, some of the boxes and, oh, look at this. 
Holy cow. Look at these paper clips. What did they're big enough? I think not. A crafter can always find something to do. Teeny weeny bits and big pieces. These leaves are beautiful. Leaves and berries. Oh, the little. Oh, uh -huh. we got a carrot out of the garden, I see. Back here in the back, you can see her with my horrible lighting. Oh, this is mm, too fun. Oh, here's some more of these little tiles. And these two, these are in black, but they are, um, they've got a spark, they've got a sparkle to them when you hold them to the light. And of course, my big hands are in the way, so you can't see anything. Let me see, there's a, I think there's a little bit more in here. Oh, here's some more. I really, oh, look at these. Th these teeny tiny. I love that. And I've never seen these little tiles before. But they're gorgeous and I know I will be able to find something to do with them. All of them. I promise. That is <laughs> more than anyone should be given <laughs> ever but my dear little sis you have got me well on my way for the next few swaps I'm sure I will have enough here to uh, get me through those and you girls keep up your your uh, videos and half of you are showing me the new things to do. And I know Sybil is uh, starting her color classes for us. And Kim, in her beautiful new home, is, is uh, always there to let us know where the good prices are. And... Um, and just so many of you that I remember and and uh, went for a long time not even being able to watch but um, I'm back now and I hope I hope to be back to stay won't be doing as much um, video uh, work as I did before I will hope to do maybe one or two a month um, especially with the work that I'll be doing for shares with uh, creating a crafty life but um, I just enjoy keeping up with you all and um, I'm glad to be back and so until the next time folks this is Tilly bye for now